is going on again YouTube this is your boy reckoning 17 bringing you his second commentary wow. uh, what we're gonna talk about today um you know just random stuff random games coming out what I've been up to uh, like in this game in particular I was playing with uh, disturb Bubness and Daniel a couple people I normally play with every once in a while when they're on but uh, I went in this game 25 and 0 with a game winning kill AC 130 I will not complain about that I mean it's not a MOAB obviously because they don't stack but it's still a really solid gameplay you know had no, really no troubles, troubles killing the other team I think they had some lobbies on there but I'm not gonna worry about it because they shouldn't have played against me but uh yeah what we're gonna talk about is like I said different games like I'm gonna bring up some Halo 4 some uh, Gears of War 3 so pretty much any type of shooter like I said I'm a big fan of shooters don't really play many RPGs, but I've been playing uh, King of Amalur Reckoning. Uh, funny story, haha, yeah. It's, you know, got my name in it. But, uh, yeah. I haven't played much uh, Modern Warfare 3 as of lately. I've been playing a lot of Gears of War. Uh, not going to say this is this game's died on me a little bit. It's just, you know, the friends I usually play with aren't, aren't normally on much uh, because of my job. I'm working at uh, Buffalo Wild Wings right now serving. But, you know, when I do play, it's usually with, like, a couple friends, like I say. And, but it's pretty nice, because, you know, I hardly ever lose. But anyways, back to the different topics. Uh, we're going to talk about Halo 4 a little bit. I am ecstatic about this game. Uh, you know, even though Bungie's not making it anymore, it's 343, but, you know, they're kind of like, if you, if you want to call them off-brand or not, but, I mean, you... You can't complain about it. It looks amazing. The gameplay looks solid. I mean, yeah, we've only seen like maybe 10 seconds of multiplayer, but the things they look like they've redone with the lighting, you know, telling a little more backstory to Master Chief about, do they say they're going to humanize him a little bit? It's going to be really nice. I mean, it's set for later this year, but they keep on, you know, saying holiday season, which I'm hoping it's sooner than later, but I want them to get everything done. Hopefully, hoping they come out with a beta like they did Reach. Uh, found out they're bringing back the old school battle rifle, which will be nice because that three round burst is just sexy in general. But um, yeah, they are bringing over some new Spartans called the Spartan 4, I believe it was. It's supposed to be like a Spartan with higher armor and everything. Oh, by the way, they get really fucking close to me right here. Look at that. I don't know how they didn't see me or get me or anything. But yeah, it's just the, uh, they showed a couple maps. One was Wraparound. I forget what the other one was, but they said this time that any of the bases of multiplayer maps are not going to be on the, uh, in the storyline. So they're not basing any maps off the storyline from what they've told, and they're just short Vidoc, which they'll probably release like a longer version within maybe a couple weeks or so. I mean, it. Like I said, the game looks astounding already. The detail, they've. You can definitely tell they've changed it since Reach, because you know, everything is just. Like, I can't say how much it's. It's amazing. Uh, another game we we're going to talk about was Black Ops 2. Uh, I know we haven't heard much about it. We don't even know if it's guaranteed Black Ops 2, but just because Activision bought the name, doesn't necessarily mean that they are going to come out with it. Uh, since I'm a big gaming nerd, I'm probably going to look into it a lot more. Uh, because usually when I am the one playing the game, I'm the one usually infoing my friends about, oh, this is coming out or this is coming up. Uh, you might want to look into it. And I usually talk them into buying it, too, just because it's really nice to play, you know, have friends to Damn, game with. Because, I, I mean, especially in Halo, wow. me and my buddy uh, Kyle... We like to drive around the Warthog a lot and just mess around. I mean, we play to win, but I mean, most of the time, it's just Warthog gunning or going after people, just dicking around. Halo is more of that laid-back style game. That's probably why I like it so much. Call of Duty is more serious and everything, you know. So I'm not gonna complain too much. But uh, yeah, guys, like I said, Halo 4 cannot complain. Um, this is my, like I said, second commentary. And I will just let you guys know shortly when I'm coming out third. I'm currently also working on a possible Gears of War 3 montage. 
I've also got a second Modern Warfare 3 montage on the way too, guys. So always check out for that. Uh, might also start some clips of the day if you guys want to send me some in. Or, you know, just fails of the week. But, uh, guys, thanks for watching. Uh, if you like the video, like, subscribe, comment, tips, pointers, anything helps to get me going, guys. This is Reckoning17, sign off. Later, guys.